Well, here's a shot from the ore bin. Circa 1888, probably early 1900s. Got a three compartment ore bin. This thing is huge, it's about the size of a damn house. That's some real, real big old timbers. These things are at least 10, 12 inches. Old wooden dowels holding this sucker in place. Tell you what, man, they just don't build them like they used to. Let's take a gander on the bottom side and see what it looks like. people leaving all their fucking garbage out here guys pack it in pack it out take your rubbish with you would you i think it's pretty big three shoots a whole bunch of cribbing on the bottom there it's kind of hard to believe that after 140 years this thing's still sitting here it's probably been about 130 actually Overgrown road there. There's something leading off down that way. I'll have to check that out in a minute. What's this? This one's probably part of one of the ore chutes. Something came off. Who knows? Dang, that thing is huge. That's like 15, 20 feet tall. Pretty cool, guys. Got some twine. Where in the hell did this shit come from? That's modern. Really, guys? Someone likes your Copenhagen. Ding. Ooh. Got some metal down here. Metal chutes, I'm assuming. Part of the, the ore bin. I don't know why it's down there. Well, forest fire did come through here quite a few years ago, but if that structure is still standing, since it didn't get touched, I don't know why that's down there. Must be something else. This might be another loading dock for something. You know, they, they said they packed the stuff out on the back of mules and uh, hiked it over the mountain quite a few, quite a few miles to get to the railroad, the old Northern Pacific Railroad up in... Uh, Paradise, Montana. Paradise. And that's probably how they got it out. And this might be the original road in. Uh, like I said, it's pretty overgrown. But anyways, we'll get some more video.